We'll be talking more about what causes the fire situation out in California to be so severe this year in just a second. It's some amazing weather going on out there. For us, our weather is amazingly calm. It is delightful. It was perfect for a holiday weekend. Finishing it up on a terrific note here. The look from the St. Joseph Hospital weather bug camera. A little breeze wafting, a little bit of an east breeze, and you're seeing really almost a cloudless sky for us. So for us, by most definitions, it's pretty much perfect. Our friends to the west are getting extremes of every conceivable variety. We'll talk about that coming up in the eight day. We'll talk about our next chances for rain, which really aren't until the weekend. So you look out today and when the dew point numbers, you don't really see that on a thermometer, but you feel it. When you walk out and those dew point numbers are in the, you know, the mid 60s, it's bordering on being humid. It's enough that it doesn't have that crisp fall feel that we had on Saturday for the Derby. It feels more like a summer day out there today, and we'll keep that through a good chunk of the week as well. Your air temperatures, nothing extreme here. We're running low and mid 80s off the Kentucky Mesonet KY Mesonet.org. You can see it there on the Internet. Find your favorite town. You look out, it's 83 in Barville, it's 83 in Somerset, it's 83 in Stanford, Harrodsburg, Lawrenceburg, Cynthiana, Winchester, all at that 83 degree mark. South side of Lexington, it's 82. West side at the airport, it's also 82. Well, and wind showing southwest there at 10, 82, 62. Your range of temperatures today. Rain chances, well, we'll go with zero tomorrow and Wednesday, and essentially negligible Thursday and Friday as well. Saturday and Sunday, there are your best rain chances coming in. Max Track Live Doppler locally. Not a thing is going on. We can find rain, in fact, some good thunderstorms. You have to go all the way to I-70 to find them, so no threat to us at all. In fact, not coming this way. We'll start you at 7 o'clock this evening. There is a front up there thinking, okay, here it comes. Except that front doesn't. It goes stationary. As it does so, we continue with our terrific weather. We're going to talk more about that blue stuff you're seeing there in just a second, which technically is white stuff, but here on the map we show it as blue. For us tomorrow, again, lots and lots of sunshine out there. We'll continue on into Wednesday. Not a whole lot of change. We may see a couple more clouds Wednesday, but still a mostly sunny affair for us. So what's been going on out west and why the fire has situation has been just so grave for those folks? It's record heat. And it's record seasonal heat as well. You're seeing temperatures this afternoon and going into the evening. Well, evening for us, but it's still late afternoon for them in the 110s to 120s. Actually, I want to back that up for you one more time. We're going to show you the map one more time. We're going to skip through ahead because there's something I really wanted to show you here and I forgot. Watch Denver. Watch out there in western Kansas. You want to talk about a cold front coming? Watch this. So again, the heat out in California, the heat out there through the Rockies and Plains. So Denver has been in the 90s to around 100. Look at what happens tomorrow afternoon. They are in the mid 30s. The folks in Kansas, North Texas are dropping down into the 30s. After this incredible heat, they are going to stay cold. Not only cold. OK, how about this? From going from near 100 degrees to they could get a half to a foot of snow. I mean, you want to talk about amazing stuff. That's it for tonight. We're amazingly nice. Great night. Mid 50s under actually the mid 60s under a clear sky. 80 is your forecast high tomorrow. And along with that, it's going to be a terrific day. You're looking ahead actually closer to 90 tomorrow. 90 again on Wednesday, upper 80s on Thursday, mid 80s on Friday. And then you get rain chances coming in this weekend.